Hey, Gossamer Gear fans, this is Francis Tapon with WanderLearn.com, and I'm going to test out not just their, the Gossamer Gear Ranger backpack that I've got on, but the best innovation, the crotch pot, perhaps one of the best innovations ever in the history of backpacking, because you're hotter than you think. So what I'm going to take to see how it works, I'm going to take some just uh, noodles, you know, these instant noodles that you buy for cheap, and I'm going to smash them up because they cook faster when you do that. And I'm going to go and get some water from down here. Hold on. Okay. Now we have some nice sewage water that uh, we, we're not going to treat because <laughs> we're real men. <laughs> God, that's disgusting. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> you just take regular spring water <coughs> and you pour it into your plastic bag. Oh, God. <laughs> That's about enough. <coughs> you zip up the Ziploc and make sure you do it tight unless you want a nice little accident in your pants. And now comes the magic. You're going to take the crotch, put it inside your crotch pot. And because you're so hot, you're going to take your crotch pot. I don't know if they allow this on YouTube pornographic stuff I'm about to do. Uh, Gossamer Gear gives these, these little carabiners, micro carabiners, very lightweight of course. I connect one loop to one and uh, if you don't have uh, uh, th something to hook it up on, you know, like a belt or a belt thing, you, you guys are innovative backpackers, you can figure these things out. A little tricky here. Anything for a good meal, huh? Okay, so now, as you can see, it's dangling. I don't know if I'm even doing this right. And now, this nice cold water, you're going to put heat it up in your crotch and hope for the best. Hope, you know, now I've got a serious package, which is every man's dream. It's feeling kind of wet. Maybe I didn't seal it very well. Huh. All right. I hope it's not too wet. Uh, so now I'm going to go uh, backpack for a few minutes. I swear it's leaking. Either that or I'm peeing on myself. It's probably that I'm peeing. You know, I'm an old man at this point, so men have trouble with incontinence, and that's probably me. All right, well, I'm gonna hope for the best and hope that I don't pee too much. So I'll be back in about 15 minutes of hiking and uh, wish me the best. Oh yeah, this is feeling just nice and dandy here. Little wet crotch pot. Woo! Well, what a good day for a, a crotch pot. So I've just finished cooking, as you can tell. I finished cooking, and how did you know that? Well, honey, I am happy to see you. Uh, uh, there we are. Oh, God. No wonder. Yeah, well, okay, so once again, it's uh, important not to... Uh, to, it's important to zip the Ziploc closed. This is one of my problems that I have. I don't close the Ziploc very well, so as a result, you get this shit happening. Uh, sorry about that. It looks like urine, but actually it's just the color. Well, maybe I did pee in it. I don't know. You know, when you're a backpacker, you're really not picky about what you eat. And you know, I forgot my spoon and utensils, so now's the time to test this stuff out. Does it pass the taste test? Mm. Mm. You know, I'm really not the pickiest eater of all. Oh, it's spicy. Mm. It's a little bit crunchy. I haven't given it enough time. Probably if I had gone for like an hour, it would be uh, a little softer. If the recipe says cooks in five minutes, or two minutes or five minutes or less, then that's something that you could put in your crotch. But if it takes like 15 minutes or more to cook, like wild rice and that kind of stuff, probably not a good idea unless you really want to hike with it for like a couple of hours. Mm. Well, there you have it. I walked from Mexico to Canada and back without a stove. And I really could have used a crotch pot because I, I would put cold couscous in a bag like this and eat it the next morning after it's soaked overnight. But if it was in my crotch, 
that would be kind of warm. So, there's your tip for the day. Crotchpot, less than, I think it's 20 bucks or something like that. And you too could have a hot meal because you're hotter than you think. This is Francis Tapon encouraging you to wander and learn.